Well, the good news, air quality has been improving throughout the second half of the day and will get much better tonight and not a problem for tomorrow either. You see a little more bluer sky out there right now, 77 degrees. Temperature is trying to get back to 80 and still below normal. The upper level low that sits north of Lake Superior is a cold pool of air, creating clouds and showers in the UP, so it was kind of a chilly day up there. But you see the warmth that we've had and more out to the west, which will be coming this way later in the week. Uh, tomorrow we do share in some of that. So the uh, quality alert, air quality alert will expire. Look at all the low cloudiness off to our northwest. So tomorrow starts nice and sunny. We'll have a few stray clouds in the afternoon, but should stay rain-free. As not until late Wednesday, we worry about that kind of issue coming our way. But that upper level low will go back up into Canada by the end of the week, and we'll be back in some pretty decent weather. So here's your hour by hour tonight. Let's call it totally clear, and the lows will go down to the low to mid 50s. Very comfortable night. Tomorrow, sunny skies in the morning, partly cloudy in the afternoon. High temperature is going to get back up uh, close to that 80 degree mark. Kind of a cool start that makes us uh, stop shy of that. For Wednesday, a west flow will bring temperatures back into the mid 80s. A very sunny day until late. You see the showers and storms out to the west. That gets here overnight Wednesday and into Thursday morning. So we stay dry during the daytime on Wednesday in a very summer-like feel at 85 for your high. There are the showers and storms racing in for the overnight and for Thursday morning. We'll get some afternoon sunshine and cool down slightly then for the rest of the week. You see the seven-day forecast has numbers in the mid-80s, Wednesday and parts of Thursday, and then cooler but dry for the weekend, maybe a stray shower Sunday or Monday.